Oh we even washed all the poop off for you. Uh oh. How mighty kind of you. WA2S Films, an award winning nonprofit conceived to explore, observe, and produce programs about human animal interaction. On this episode of The Rescuer's DNA. The, uh, the Dr. Peter, um, we need to see what, uh, what is the technique that he used with the chemical one, okay? So, everybody, I want you here and we will start. Okay, so what we're gonna do with the dog is chemical castration, as you know. Um, normally, what we do is we measure every testicle to see what's the why of the testicle and we measure it in millimeters. Okay, so for example, if there is from one mini, uh, one testicle that measures uh, uh, 16 millimeters of Y, then we have to put into that testicle 0 0.5 milliliters so of the calcium chloride. When you're injecting the testicle, you can feel how hard it gets. Okay, so you start injecting and and you gotta do it, do it very slow. And you gotta put the te the syringe, the, the needle, inside the testicle and leave it over there. Not moving it back and forward, just leave it in one point and start injecting. One, you, once you feel it's, going, it's having some resistance, you, you can pull back until you put inside the whole, uh, um, the total, uh -huh, the, the whole quantity that you expected and then you just release the needle, okay, the syringe, because it cannot go back, you know, because when you when you take away, if there's a drop of the medication on the needle, it can harm the testicle, okay, from the out and the skin. Okay, so uh, that's a very important part. Can you actually feel when you enter the testicle, so you have a guide point? Can you tell it's gone into the testicle? You have to make sure it's into the testicle. Right. Very sure. If you right. can feel, we do like walks into testicles. You can feel when kind of you got it toward the toward the yes. forward and and make. You'll right just the feel the difference yeah. between the skin. There's like a little pop, and then it goes yeah, into the it. testicle. Okay. That's mm -hmm. You can feel it's going to become like a rock. And you're you're, you're locating centrally. Centrally, uh -huh. very centrally, not. And do you go through the epididymis? Uh -huh, exactly. Yes. You, have you to inject push. through the epididymis and put the needle into the center of the testicle. That's the point of location from there to inject. Okay, one and um, another thing is that it's not necessary to clean the, the scrotum. We don't shave, we don't clean. We, we just put it like that. And we don't have to clean before or after. Because if the dog feels something, that something has gone, it's gonna start leaking. And we don't want that, okay? Uh, because if there's a drop, that we don't want that also. I mean, a drop on the scrotum or whatever, outside of the testicle, if they lick it, then the tongue is gonna harm. Okay? Giselle, explain how many times you change the needle from introducing into the yes, bottle. That was, that okay. was another thing, very important. That's, uh, that's the reason why changing the needle is important. We use one needle for, for the bottle to take it out from the bottle, okay? And we use a new needle for every testicle. Because we don't want even from the empty, I mean, we don't want anything uh, contaminated with the calcium chloride to come in, okay? Because if, if the needle is contaminated, when you put in, then you touch the skin with the calcium chloride and the skin can just Okay, one, one important thing on, on the, is on the important that level. not even a drop comes out of the testicle. Like the because if this product comes out of the testicle, it will just rip away all and the skin. That token, I have an eight, a dog and eight the dog eight, will just have a mark wound very big. You know, it's just, it's, okay, that's important. DNA level if and this happens, you know, then what you should do is to infiltrate saline solution, like very big. So it, it dilutes really and nothing happens. A lot of okay? So this is very important because if, we, if we're mm -hmm. working with dogs that are going to be released into the streets again, right? yeah, 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 we don't yeah. want nothing to but happen to the them because head. nobody's going to be following yeah, them. No, <laughs> okay? And it's very Zuterin is not permanent. And here our, we have this screw is worms you and they get screw worms worm and because of the wound they just can die. Not because of the chemical castration but because of the secondary. 
exactly. but, but that is where okay. there is fruit. Okay, so we have the first thing yeah. to do. <laughs> okay, <laughs> I always do the one testicle first. I, I always do the left one and then the right one. Because, yes. <laughs> yeah, just what you do. That's what I do. Uh -huh. So, you see, you put the testicle and you can do this. Okay, open it a little bit more. Okay, so we measure exactly 20 millimeters. Okay, so I'm going to the chart. It says from 19 to 22 millimeters, from 0.8 to 1 millimeter. I'm gonna take one. Okay, so here I got the needle of the bottle. <laughs> You don't want any ball of air inside. And I take a little bit more, just in case. Leave it over there, and then take it. One new needle. 23? 22 or 23. 22 or 23. One, we're basically 22, 23, anywhere from three quarters to one and a quarter inch. This is the injection, which takes time. You need to take your time from anywhere to 30, 45 to 60 seconds per testicle to inject. That is obviously to slowly introduce the fluid and give it a chance to start dissipating throughout the, uh, the testicle. Okay, now I feel that it's full over there, but I still have half a mouth. So I put it away a little bit and I continue to do But I know that I'm not out of the testicle. How do you know that? Just feeling? Because I know the wa the long the length of the needle down. and I know the size. I can imagine. Okay, so it's it's that. That's it. It doesn't fit in. It, it makes resistance to put that little bit inside. So I just don't touch it anymore. And the skin of the scrotum, you got. I mean, the scrotum, you got to do it like this. Okay, this is. This can come out normally. This doesn't come out, but this is from the epididymis. This is not from the testicle. Okay, so that's it. You just try with anything, not alcohol, nor anything. Okay, and that's it. And remember the tattoo. Just doing a line. Because yes, the rest of those cells are not. Can I make stimulated by a dart or a crescent moon or, or butterfly? Butterfly, butterfly yes. would be okay. good. And well, the thing is, we, we want to make ball tattooing chic, right? And you don't glue that, you just leave it for and just say it? Okay. Mm -hmm. okay. Yeah. Yeah. No. Gonna, who's going to be University the one who needs who to know? Who would, that. like, look for you a know, tattoo and go, to oh, because not too many people are going to be looking at these dogs except for professionals, here. Exactly. Like, I do it, like, yes. I do it, like, right here, because it's next to the testicle. If you do it in the ear, then you're going to do a surgery. You see the testicle, but the first thing that is going to come to your mind is not chemical castration. So, so it's gonna be. That. We, we have to neuter this dog. So if, if the mark is next to the testicle, then you can see. It. I don't do it in the and scrotum you because it's a aggression. pigmentation. I know we have that now. <laughs> <laughs> Straight ahead. Straight ahead. Straight in the corner. Yeah, anywhere. So they don't he's get any to go. shots? No, he's ready to go. Okay. It's just that. Perfect. Yep. Injected with calcium chloride probably Friday, and some of it went sub Q, and this is the result of it. And the best thing they say to do is just to keep it clean and it will heal on its own. And the effect will still be the same. He will be he will be neutered. Or he'll be impotent. So they're discussing whether they're gonna take it. So you know how but they're not as hard. I guess they can be but they don't be all healed. So you don't do that. See, there's his tattoo showing he was done. So that's what happens if it isn't done quite right. So did you receive instructions what to no. do with the dog? No. Yeah, they're there's gonna get saline and they're gonna rinse it, rinse it, rinse it, rinse it. Here, not here. Got to take it. Leave the dog here. Do not move the dog. Thank you. You're here because you love animals. Help save a life today. 
Your donation will send the World Animal Awareness Society team on our next mission. From all of us here at the World Animal Awareness Society and WA2S Films, thank you for watching The Rescuer's DNA. We'll see you next time. It's an animal world out there. Watch the World Animal Awareness Society channel and feel right at home. Come, sit, subscribe, and stay a while.